What's up, my Bones people? <laughs> we're up to season two, episode seven of Bones. I wonder what kind of bones we're gonna uncover today. Shall we? Shall we throw a little guess? What? What? Hmm. Hmm. Maybe they're stuck. They're they're bones like stuck in like pipes, you know, like. <laughs> Someone's out there trying to clear and clean some pipes, and they find, like, this leg bone. Or whatever. I don't know. Here we go. They found a victim in the filtration system. This, you know, it's a bone, and nobody knows what to make. Look, no way! There's no bones in it, though, is there? So, okay, I wasn't that... Okay, I was kind of there. I was kind of there. Okay, what? Okay, that's... I... I need to buy a lottery ticket. That's the craziest thing I've ever done right there. That, that's not far off. Y'all are gonna think I just knew this. That's... I, I can't explain that. That's... <laughs> I mean, that's not far off. That's like... That's insane. Bones found in a filtration system. I mean, they weren't cleaning the pipes, they just found it. It wasn't a leg bone, it was the whole bone. Listen, the bureau's that are running location checks for Ray Street Pepper. Don't you have work? You do? Don't you? She has false teeth. And the other teeth were veneered. What is she, a midget stripper? Okay, this is the color she what? might have from the bleaching. Swings? Yeah. You know how high can I go if I twist the chains, how fast will I spin? What if I try to jump off before the swing stops? Exactly. I miss that feeling. They are. Me too. I miss organic chemistry class. Those are good times. <laughs> I miss my first microscope. Right, yeah, and I miss normal people. Can we go on? <laughs> Factor in the teeth. She looks 30. That's not a... Run the image against the database now. Oh my god. That's Brianna Swanson. She's not your dog. Why are you dressing a nine-year-old up like that? Can we can we talk a little bit about how I I like guessed that it was bones in a pipe and I wasn't that far off like I literally was not that far off at all and I just randomly guessed it and y'all are probably not gonna believe me and I don't care because I am I I feel awesome <laughs> a nine-year-old is hardly mature enough to make an informed decision about what you were at the competition <laughs> the bill where we I think this is ridiculous. Why are nine-year-olds doing this? Do nine-year-olds actually do this? Is this a real thing? Dress up nine-year-olds like that? For a beauty pageant? They're nine. Once when we were fighting, he said that he would rather have Brianna end up in a ditch somewhere than turn out like me. Motive. Or... Potential. Big uh, suspect. Her neck was broken. Dislocated fracture of the mandible suggests her death was caused by a strong blow to the chin. This is Jackie's doing, right? You wanted your daughter back. This is who I wanted back. I don't want her funeral to be some disgusting show Jackie puts on. Damn. Oh, I want to bury her with some love. You know? Damn. So, mom wanted to turn her into like a little doll. Dad didn't Let's want go. her. I didn't want that. FBI sent over the security tapes from Divorced. the hotel where Brianna's pageant was held. Could you ever do this to your kid? You know me. I'm all about the swings. Yeah, honestly. Did you something? Uh, yeah. I didn't know so nine-year-olds did this. I mean, I knew like high school people did it. Cellulose. That's all on the parents. Nine-year-olds are too young to. Uh... We've been. I want to be in a beauty pageant. Months now. I know what that means. But if the field weakens, they fly apart. Dude, just kiss life. already! Jesus! I'm sick and tired of this! Come on, we owe it to ourselves to give it a try. I mean, we work together, Jack. 
Angela. I'm sorry. I'll examine the paper after I go through the videos. Sure. This is the rib cage of a healthy 10-year-old girl. And what caused the deformity? Was it genetic? It was a corset. Tightened a little more each day. Brianna slept in one every night. That's torture. That, yeah, that's, that's child abuse. That, that's, that's why I'm saying nine-year-olds are too young. You know, we all have aspects of ourselves we might wish were different. Yes, I wanted larger biceps before I became comfortable with my mental acuity. <laughs> Here, you can see Cribra orbitalia, suggesting Brianna suffered from long-term malnourishment. There's no enamel erosion to indicate bulimia. Her tox screen came back with traces of somatropin, tocycline, and glycoperonium bromide. Dude, Even that's growth hormone, broad full blown child abuse. Used to treat acne and a chemical mixture that controls perspiration. All with serious side effects. But she no likes it. She's it. nine. So mom, this mom is on the parent. And drugged her. Yep. Society puts a premium on beauty. Common in declining cultures. Too and young. Jesus. They should be outlawed. What would happen? That's ridiculous. If your daughter refused to compete. Let your kids live normal lives, people. This was Brianna's dream, not mine. No. You put your Your child's in nine! She doesn't place. have dreams like that. It's not a realistic thing. Do you ever think to tell you Brianna that she need to alter her physical appearance in order to be loved? Or I want to look like, like my dog. No, she was a perfect okay, angel. Sweetie. She won every competition, even her first one. She was a real She doesn't know she any better. She reflected well on you. I don't like her. <laughs> I love her, so piss <laughs> off. We had a disagreement. In a disagreement with your nine-year-old yeah, about a... Piece. I suggested she use her elbow to hit the last note with her head in her hands, give the audience a little smile. It's called dazzle. No, she didn't want to do that. It's very silly now. You're having a and conversation like this about it. Now you're what happened to me as I'm following this. Very large glass of rosé. And believe me, I was not the only mother doing the exact same thing. Great. I'm sure you can uh, provide me with a list of the other mothers. Well, I don't think the mother or the father did it. I think there was there's a guilty so she was like era. After she died. The blows appear to be consistent with kicking. What is it? The dispersal What's the word? Is abnormal. Only Jealous they party out rich. there. <laughs> Hodgins asked me out. Is that why you're hiding in here? I need advice. What, on a personal matter? Yes. For me? Yes. <laughs> romance is sort of... This is like me asking you advice on phylogenetic systematics. Phylogenetic systematics. I have no idea what that is. Exactly. I just came to ask if you'd made any progress on the cellulose. No. Okay. <laughs> it would be a disaster. All of a sudden you have an opinion on this? You should never indulge in a romantic relationship with someone you work with. Why not? Well, anthropologically? There's an anthropological answer? <laughs> the official workplace is predicated upon a simple hierarchy. This is... Like when I had an affair with my thesis supervisor in college. Don't think we have time for that. I say go. <laughs> what about the- It's always fun to flirt in the workplace, but out there, when fantasy becomes a reality, it's a drag. I was wanted to take dance, but I was so gawky and uncurrent. See, it's one thing if they're having fun Later and like, you know, it's just so all fun and games, but it's not fun and games. This is like a serious, yeah, yeah. like, just forcing yeah. your child to be serious and do Which one's yours? ridiculous things. Which one is fit? That's my daughter, Ariel, by the bar with the gray leg wash. I can't help but wonder what if you think Ariel got kidnapped. Why do you assume she was kidnapped? There's a lot of pressure with probably not. Too much Ariel. pressure. That's the thing, there shouldn't be pressure on a nine-year-old. And there shouldn't be drugs and tight freaking clothing and yelling at from your parents. There's enough pressure on young females without making them prematurely sexualized. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that is just narrow-minded prejudice. I was in pageants my entire childhood. They sent me to college on a full scholarship. Look at her face! Ooh, nice I'm glad the three of us agree. Focus. <laughs> I hope you find the man responsible. That's all that matters to me. Oh, you know, why don't, uh, why don't you go mingle? What do I need? Because you're a girl. It's illegal for me to question any of these kids without their parents, okay? Look, they're civilian. Ah. Uh -huh. Good point. Smart. Tibison Harrison. Ooh. Ah. 
The presence of these two species together suggests that she died within a one mile radius of the hotel where she disappeared. That oh. whole area was thoroughly searched within hours of her disappearance. Yeah. Not well enough. Storm culvert for over a month until those thunderstorms two weeks ago. Washed the remains down to the treatment plant. The FBI forensics should check out the culverts and drains large enough for a nine year old girl around the hotel. I'll tell Booth. It's disgusting. <laughs> it never occurred to me that you would. Okay, now you talk. <laughs> I accept. Going on a date with you. Soon. Tonight? Wow. <laughs> that is soon. What do you want to do? You ask me. Figure it out. Ooh. I mean, you are technically supposed to be the one that figures it out. <laughs> she shows it, please. No. Why not? Because he's not some murderous pedophile. He's the 17-year-old brother of one of the contestants. I know he dresses in black and mopes around, but he's totally harmless. Oh, my God. I'm going to need a copy of this picture. Certainly. You're an idiot. Sorry, I'll stop <laughs> yes, of a 12-year-old from the Bronze Age. These bones show she'd already had children. What killed her? Having the children. She should have waited to be married before she had sex. You <laughs> said sex. Were you girls in the Junior Miss Patriot pageant? It must have been hard to lose your friend like that. Brianna was kind of mean. She said Liza had cankles. What are cankles? <laughs> Where your calves and your ankles are the same thing. So you weren't friends? You had to be friends with her. Why? Because the corruption of these children. Was the queen. So yours was a cultural structure. You instinctively <laughs> align yourselves with. Oh my god! It's. Oh my god! A Darwinian pressure you're too young to bear. Oh my god! Okay, come on, bones up, you go. <laughs> <laughs> He's picking up his kid. Huge muscles. Thanks. Brianna was kicked with a steel to the boot. Looks like my possible suspect just became our primary suspect. That's creepy. It's not emo, it's not anything. You have a girlfriend? He does. She looks exactly like him. Do you have like <laughs> a real boyfriend and girlfriend? What do you mean? She's picking on my little sister. Oh. Not the shoes. And they're too broad and rounded to have caused the damage to Brianna Swanson's bones. You do it. Why? Because I have a date. <laughs> said about how you used to feel on a swing. Huh. Looks like colored He's... dots, but so faded. That's good. Could this be a candy bar wrapper? The cheapest, worst ice cream bar you can get. Available only at Ridgehead Convenience Stores. <laughs> Ridgehead, what you need now. And now. <laughs> I thought they stopped making them. Yeah, I thought I just ate them all. <laughs> well, maybe we should determine how Brianna Swanson got a hold of one. Look, I wouldn't laugh so hard if I knew it was Brianna Swanson. <laughs> she laughed hard regardless. Yeah, yeah. Back. yeah. yeah. Back. <laughs> you look much better here. Better than a dream, huh? You're shameless. All right, you better get, you are gonna kill yourself. Breaking finally. Jesus. These are God's food. <laughs> Go have a look around. What are we looking around at? Oh. Well. A metal. It's Kristen Mandy. The mother that I spoke with at the dance school was named Kristen. It's like that Texas cheerleading thing where the mother took out her daughter's main competitor. Mm. Mm. Well, we found Brianna Swanson's crime scene. Can you explain that? Mm. I'm not saying another word until I get a lawyer. One. That's two. insane. Left side only? Yes. Left footed? I need to know if her hips are even. Is that slang or do you really mean even? <laughs> what 
What's going on here? Where's my attorney? Okay, try and get a shot of her buttocks and freeze it. You might as well let her go, Boo. Why? She has very nice symmetrical buttocks. <laughs> well, yeah, I know that, but, um... What is that doing here? Brenna Swanson's attacker has a Thor Columbar curve. Prince and Mitchell is definitely not the killer. Damn it! Keep striking out, Mitchell. Shit. She showed Brianna her mom with metal. A four-stop trail. What? A what? Hello. It's from the parking lot at the red shake. From the ah, house. that's why it focused in on her stepping on it. This is a blood on it. It's a match. The angle and force of the blow caught her chin here. <laughs> Instantly. Remember the polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons I talked about? Absolutely not. Turns out that they weren't from roofing tar. They were from asphalt. It is the exact same steel used in tap shoes. It's from another contestant. No way. One of the... One of the other kids we killed her? To examine the symmetry of her hips. I'm, I'm not a molester. I'm a forensic anthropologist. Okay, FBI business. Everybody just simmer down. She touched me on my rear. <gasps> no, back and rear have totally different connotations. Scientist or not, FBI or not, she can't just go around feeling little girls. Well, I wasn't feeling like <laughs> that. That makes me sound you know, like she a was just, She was just a... Okay, listen, bud, we're after a murderer here, okay? Dr. Brennan just got a little overly excited. How does feeling little girls <laughs> One of them is the murderer. If I could just watch them. Let's watch. What are we watching for? I don't understand how you can tell. This is so disturbing. Dude, you're dressing up nine-year-olds like this. That is incredibly disturbing. Could it have been his sister? Nona said she was getting by me an ice cream. But she just made fun of me. She said I was ugly. She said I never want anything. I must have hurt your feelings. I didn't mean to push her so hard on us. Bad to the story. I wanted to win. Kids don't know anything. They don't know how they feel. They don't know what they want. We didn't really get a They're kids. They don't have the mental ability yeah. like adults do. I was avoiding you. They should not be in a oh, scenario like that. Thing. It's too much. It was supposed to fall flat. That way we both know that this wasn't meant to be. And we go back to the way we were before. Well, I don't like the way it was before. Friends. Sure. Friends. Really? Just one question. What if it doesn't go wrong? There's always that what if. Friends. You're worried about it going wrong. You just gotta live life, people. You just gotta live life. If it goes wrong, it goes wrong. If it doesn't, woo it doesn't. The girl in the pink could really dance. But then again, Nero could really play the fiddle. Yeah, you know, Bones, I like to think that, um... I never understood that. Well, I mean, no, of course you wouldn't. Why? It's just, you know, someone who looks like you, what well, wouldn't. I don't understand what... Aww. The way do it look. I don't get it, hold you. Aww, that's... You're structured. Aww, that's sweet. Very well. <laughs> yes, how are you? <laughs> I just, I remember that I had an appointment. He doesn't want her, he wants her. But no. he's, he's weird about... You know, you have all the paperwork for the case, right? I'm here to help. Whoa. What about your appointment? Uh, it's, you know, it's no big deal. Oh, so he's gonna stay. How about I, uh, order some makeup and I ditch these donuts? Sure. There is some stuff going on in this lab. You were pretty focused on the Friday. 
It's a game. The game is who makes the first move. <laughs> I don't know who it's going to be. I feel like it'll... Ah. You know what? I feel like it might be her. I feel like that would be a great character development or whatnot if it was her. I, I think I would like that. Um... Yeah, uh, it's it's never great to see instances of kids dying in, in any kind of show. Um, it's just, it ugh, feels weird. Um, obviously, I'm not a fan of pageants. <laughs> or anything like that with children. Um, nor am I a fan of almost anything other than just a basic childhood for for children because they that's what they deserve you know kids don't kids don't deserve to have their parents be like oh yeah you got to do it this way they're kids they don't know better or you know the kid comes up to the parent they're like mom i want to be in a beauty pageant oh okay cuz that's what they really want you know cuz the they don't have wants. They don't have wants and needs. You know, one day they're going to want this. The next day they're going to want that. It's just kids. You know, they're the, they're the most innocent and just carefree among us all. And most vulnerable. And, you know, it, it's the freaking adults out there that are always the ones that just want to corrupt kids and, and make them what they're not and it, it's so irritating to me that's such a whole different other topic but um yeah parents like that not well not necessarily parents like that not saying all the parents who who take their kids to pageants are just evil human beings they're not they're not that's just not true but when they when they make it like the parents we saw they're just assholes except for that one parent the one whose actual kid was actually um, she seemed okay, but we didn't see much of her, even though her, her kid was like, I wanted to win, so clearly there were problems there, but, mm. whole different topic. <laughs> Anyways. Hodgins and Angela. There's more there. This is, I'm, I'm not convinced this is the end. She's very hesitant. He's all in. And then we have this other game being played between Booth and Brennan, and then... Yeah, it's... It, it's... We'll see. We'll see how this unfolds. Like the video, comment down below, subscribe if you have not already. I'll see y'all next time.